Returning to full consciousness is an opportunity for you to move more deeply within yourself. This is an opportunity for you to really nurture and honour who you are as a human and as a soul essence. I value each one of you simply because you are alive. I value you because you have chosen to come and be upon the earth at this time. You are each magnificent energies of light and your potentials are limitlessness. Let that be your truth and let that be your reality. Soak in the energies of potential as you are here within your space on the earth plane. Let yourself be very centered and focused within this space. I now invite you to shift your consciousness, release the energies of your body. Release the energies that hold you grounded so that your consciousness may fly and shift as you move into the space of the magnetic grid. Within this space, you find that you are linking with the energy of your higher self. Allow yourself to see what this feels like, to let your consciousness expand as you link. Once you are connected, take a moment to allow yourself to look outward, perceiving the energy pathways that are all around. As you are ready to do so, release these energies. You may feel as if you move through the interlocking grid and you move into the energies of the crystalline grid. In so doing so, you leave behind the magnetic pull of the earth. The crystalline grid does not have the specific pathways, but there are energies that vibrate in sync with the various crystals. So allow yourself to connect if you so desire. It may be with the entire grid, or it may be with a single crystal. You may now release this space. You may choose to call forth a column of light, or through your intention, you may shift through and leave behind the magnetic pull of the earth and allow yourself to connect if you so desire. There is a vibration that oftentimes feels like home to you. It is a space in which the greater amount of your soul essence or your divinity resides. Allow yourself to call forth your I am presence. Feel what this is to you. Allow your perception to take in these energies that are your vibration. There are many facets that make up the essence of who you are. Some of these are very evident to you, others are not. I, the Goddess, now come into this space. I make myself known as I link with each one of you. And as I link, you may find yourself immediately shifting so that you move into the space of all that is. Let yourself be within this immense amount 
and expanse of energy. Let me amplify your energy for you so that I may reflect back to you a greater amount of who you are. No matter how much you open, no matter how much you take in within your perceptions, there is even more of you available for yourself. So let yourself open to that which is most important for you to link at this time. So take a moment and let us focus on some of the energies that cre create struggle within your life. Do you perhaps have the belief system that you must struggle in order to succeed? Do you perhaps have the belief system that anything worth achieving is worth a struggle? From within this space of all that is, your spiritual body is bright, vibrant and deeply connected. Shift your perception until you are once more looking at your human aspect. How much of your spiritual energy is within and around you? Do you hold yourself back from being all that you can be? Can you accept that you are a uniquely divine individual? And again allow for this to flow, to move through so that there is a deeper and greater connection. Open to perceive, is there a greater flow of energy once you have consciously looked at these various aspects of yourself? You are always the creator within your life. You always have access to your higher self. And these divine energies that are here to support for you. Your linking with them is a means of opening to receive support. And they may assist you with potentials. But once more, you are the creator of all that is occurring within and around you. Let yourself feel the excitement of that. Let yourself feel the truth and what that is. See all these energies come together once more. Let yourself play with what energy you radiate. See all these energies come together once more. And from this, is it a specific color or vibration? You may shift it depending on what thoughts you send through the impulse. Become aware of the minute amount of change in your perception what you project and yet how that can have an effect. Within this vibration, subtle changes can be large. Within your cells, subtle changes can have a huge effect. From within this group, take a moment to perceive the hologram of the earth. This has become a very effective way of instilling these new energies within the earth. As this hologram is coming up within all of you, send forth your creation. Send forth your balance of yourself. Send forth that deeper link within you, yourself and your guides. The hologram takes on an iridescent light. It sparkles and shines 
and as it rotates, you perceive Lady Gaia as she comes forth. Take this moment, and as you are looking at Leia Gaia, feel the link of your human self upon the earth as she represents that back to you. So as you are looking at Lady Gaia, you are also seeing yourself as your human self walking upon the earth. Allow that image to accept this bond as a deeper and deeper level. She returns inside the earth, blending, assisting each of the energies that you are all protecting into the earth, with linking to whom you are as the human upon the earth. These energies will also diffuse throughout the earth. The hologram then begins to shift once more. It moves down, moving through the layers and vibrations of energies. As it moves through the crystalline and magnetic grid, there is an aspect of it which is deposited. Yet the ball of light that represents the hologram continues moving until it goes into the earth and anchors within. The shift in vibration that occurred with all that you did at this time then radiates, moving out from within the earth and linking with all the levels of energy within and around the earth. You may find that your physical body is receiving that impulse that you sent forth for yourself. We release that essence. Let your focus shift until you come back within this space once more of all that is. Look within yourself and look around. Breathe in the incredible joy of being within this space. Let your focus go within. Breathe in your complete blending and connection within all aspects of yourself and feel how good that is. Let yourself simply be in this space for as long as you need to be. Or let yourself come back here whenever you desire. You create from within here. You may also just come and allow yourself to simply create. Take a few moments for this, just in silence.
see what changes may be around you. Be open to the potential that there may be shifts or changes that occur that you are not anticipating. Look forward six months from now. Look forward a year through your perceptions are there aspects that become more clear with time is what you seek to manifest perhaps going to arrive more at six months or a year if now is not the right moment to fully manifest what you seek to have allow yourself to accept that you are setting the groundwork Everything you are doing has purpose. Feel as if or see yourself releasing what you are creating within your life. You may release it into a bubble. Let it flow away from you in a river or it may just evaporate. This has your energy stamp upon it. It is your creation. It is your life. In the days or weeks to come, be open to drawing that back to you. You will feel as if there are moments of what is called deja vu, as if it seems so familiar to you. If you experience that, realize that it is a signal that you have given yourself to remind yourself that all is well. This potential is within you and around you from here forth. You may wake up in the morning and it has happened already, or it may come to you at a later time. There are no set guidelines, time limit or time frame. I therefore ask you to release a specific time frame. You have each been working with specific energies of light. These may be angels or guides that you are very well acquainted with. It may be someone new to you. Allow yourself to look around and see who is sharing this space with you. Open your perceptions. Let yourself recognize who this individual is or who this group is. You may be seeking to have a greater awareness or a greater communication with your angels and guides from your human self. Allow your consciousness to create a link with any or all of the energies that are around you at this time. This link may be perceived as a beam of light. This is aligning with you at this space within your expanded awareness. But I invite you to shift your consciousness and send that beam of light down into your human self. You will feel it as a shift in energy around your physical body and within it. From your physical body, sent that back up so that it once more links within your consciousness. This creates a flow of energy that will assist you in having a greater communication or a connection with the energy and guides that are around you. It's much easier when you're already in this space of expansion. But I know you are seeking to have this within your earthbound existence. Let your awareness open to a place where it will understand what is needed to link 
take a moment to look at your emotional body. Is there anything within your emotional body that is holding back from linking fully with communication to your guides and your higher self? If you have been in a place where your emotions are shut down, take this opportunity to open up that door. Open the door to deeper and greater communication with your emotions. Is there anything within your mental body that is keeping this communication with your higher self or your guides from occurring? Is there a belief system? Is there a distrust in your ability? Are you able to release the analytical to allow for a higher vibration to come in? Open wide your mental body and let a flow of energy move through it, allowing you to feel the alignment. I put forth to you, is it possible you may manifest within your life through ease, perhaps through fun and joy? Look inside of yourself and find out in which ways you are struggling. How much of your life is filled with pain? How much of your life is based in fear? Is there anything that you are doing that is holding you within a box or within constrictions? If any of those resonated with you, bring it up within the forefront of your consciousness. Ask yourself, how is it serving you to have this within your life? Does it feel as if it's protecting you? Does it give you perhaps a sense of security? There is always a reason why this experience has come into your life. You are the creator of your life, so perhaps it is necessary to look from this level or this perspective to receive the answer for yourself. a need to put boundaries that hold you back. Release a need to feel fearful as you move through your day. And I sense swirling through this space and energy as if it's a breeze that moves through you and around you, assisting you in letting go. For many of you, it felt as if you had already let go of those energies. Others that feel as if you are going to a deeper level and releasing at an even deeper level. Again, come back within yourself and ask 
ask yourself, who is making the choices within my life? Am I fully choosing and accepting all that occurs within my life? Ask yourself, is someone else is controlling how I feel? Or is controlling what is happen happening within my life? Look at the energies around you, perhaps relationships, perhaps work, perhaps family, and ask yourself, am I going with the flow and it feels as if others are choosing my life? There is a great deal that can be happening within your life that is having an effect on you which feels as if it's beyond your control or it feels as if it's not your choice. If this is within your life at this time, then look beneath the surface because on one level or another, it is your choice. Honour yourself. Take your choices within yourself. If you come to realise you don't really like this choice, then look around at alternatives. Let your strength flow through your consciousness. I can amplify this for you if you need me to do so. You are strong. You do have the ability to make choices. Accept this reality for yourself. As you are choosing the life that you wish to lead, how does that look to you? What does it feel like to wake up in the morning excited about your day to come? What does it feel like to anticipate experiences that you wish to have for yourself? When you are manifesting upon the earth, there are many, many layers to how this occurs. Look with the inner eyes of your consciousness at all that you are seeking to manifest within your life. You will see that some areas you have already accomplished. You may see that you have already manifested this in every way. But physical consciousness on the earth. If there is anything coming to you at this time, if you perceive that there is anything standing between you and your perception of what you are manifesting, send forth a flow of energy to clear anything that may be keeping you from bringing this in. Allow yourself to reach out and embrace all that you seek to manifest. As you are embracing your creation, take note from where you are creating. Is this giving you joy? Is it bringing you peace and excitement? Do you feel any fear? Do you feel any pain? Let go of any of those emotions if they continue to linger. Step into what you seek to be who you are in a space that is filled with love, acceptance, peace and contentment and allow yourself to begin to bring that consciousness back, that consciousness which is you. Allow yourself to shift into the soul plane. You may feel as if you make a bit of a an adjustment right here but then again you move and link momentarily with the energy of the crystalline grid there are more of these crystalline energies coming into the earth this is the new energy that you yourself have been working with and bringing into your space upon the earth so you need not shift as far all that is. You may always come into this space of the crystalline grid and it is easier and easier to bring that down and surround you if you are feeling a need to shift into a higher vibration. Let 
Let yourself move once more. You will link with the energies of the magnetic grid. As you come into this space, you feel the pull of the earth. You feel what it is to be in that magnetic field. But again, it is different because you are bring, bringing with you your expanded consciousness, your expanded awareness. This space adjusts to accommodate who you are at this moment. Again, you release this space. Let your full consciousness return. Moving into your physical body. Allow the energy field around your physical body to expand if need be. And let yourself integrate more of this expanded awareness. And now the perception of your human self Feel as if you are looking up and linking with your higher self and with your guides. Allow yourself to perceive this open and direct communication. You have created this. It is yours to use in whatever way you so desire. Let those energies anchor more deeply within and around your physical self. Let the space in which you are located expand even farther to accommodate a greater amount of this energy. With that, we will shift our focus, coming back into the earth space and say, I am open to receive full consciousness now and so it is. Namaste. And thank you for coming on this journey of expanding and returning your full consciousness. <laughs>